Well, hello there, and welcome to the Goshen Scholarship and Awards Ceremony, Part 8, the Arts Edition. It's Wednesday, the first day of July, 2020, and today's awards being presented are the Alan Greenberg Memorial Award, the Roy Reese Scholarship, the Vocal Music Leadership Award, the John Philip Sousa Band Award, the Orchestra Service and Leadership Award, the Outstanding Vocal Music Awards, the Outstanding Band Person Award, the Orchestra Achievement Award, the Outstanding Jazz Band Person Award, the Vocal Music Theater Award, and the Triad Award. That's a lot of awards in one day, but we know that you won't fast forward through it because you'll be making jazz hands the entire time. Enjoy! Now that the overture is out of the way, we'll begin Act 1 with the Alan Greenberg Memorial Award, presented by Miss Kim Longo. Hi, my name is Kim Longo and I'm the band director at Goshen High School. The first award I'm presenting today is the Alan Greenberg Memorial Award. This award is very special to me because it is given in memory of the man who was my high school band teacher at Goshen High School. Alan Greenberg was a caring, dedicated teacher and an amazing musician. This award is presented each year to a graduating senior who made a significant contribution to the band program at Goshen High School and who plans to major or minor in a music program in college. It recognizes a student who is versatile, well-rounded, and involved in school and community activities. This year, there are two recipients of the Alan Greenberg Memorial Award. Envelope, please. And the winners are Ethan Moskowitz. And Eli Weinstein. Congratulations, Ethan and Eli. Next up, please welcome Mr. Roy Reese and Harleen Cressy to introduce the Roy Reese Scholarship. Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, I am here this afternoon with Harleen Cressy, and my name is Roy Reese. We are here to present the Technical Theater Awards for the 2020 school year. Uh, our show was ready to go up and it was cut short uh, by COVID-19 one week before uh, opening curtain. Uh, however, prior to that, for four months, many, many adults and many, many students worked countless hours to make this show happen. At this point, I'd like to turn the program over to Harleen. Thank you, Mr. Reese. 11 years ago, when Roy Reese retired as superintendent of schools, the PTO established a scholarship in his name to be awarded to a student or students who through dedication, maturity, and unselfishness contributed to the technical aspect of the theater at GHS. This year we have two recipients. This year's recipient worked on crew for five years. As an eighth grader, she was a regular crew member working on drama and musical productions. She was a leader and one of the first crew members to arrive at work and one of the last to leave. She has held many leadership positions during this time on crew. For this year's show, she was the senior stage manager and technical go-to person. Her name is Caroline Swift. Congratulations. Our second recipient is a four-year crew member. His interest was on lighting and color. He has not only hung, pointed, and focused hundreds of lighting fixtures, he has been a student lighting director and lighting board operator for the last two years. His name is Bryce Rufo. Congratulations, Bryce. 
Good luck to all of the members of Class of 2020. Congratulations, Caroline and Bryce. It's been a pleasure to work with you all these many, many years, and we will miss you. Thank you very much for all your dedication to all of our productions over the years. We know you'll go on to do great things. When you come back to visit GHS, please come and see this plaque, which will be hanging in the awards areas of the school, and find your names among many of other fine students who've worked on our countless productions to make them the best that they can be. Congratulations. Your names ought to be in lights. The next award being given out today are the Outstanding Vocal Music Awards. These will be presented by Marianne Lloyd and Kristen Scully. Congratulations to the Goshen High School graduating class of 2020. The Outstanding Vocal Music Award goes to a student or students who have not only been dedicated and excelled in vocal music, but also have shown commitment to the program as well as to their fellow classmates. It is my pleasure to announce that the recipients of this year's Outstanding Vocal Music Awards are Riley Doyle and Kevin Alert. Grab one of 76 trombones for the next award because it's the John Philip Sousa Band Award. This will be presented again by Miss Kim Longo. The next award I will present is the John Philip Sousa Award. This award is given each year to a student who has achieved a superior level of musical skill on his or her instrument. This year, the recipient of the John Philip Sousa Award is... Joseph Schatz. Congratulations, Joseph. Now for our first orchestra award. It's the Orchestra Service Leadership Award. Presented by Ms. Kristen Callahan. The Orchestra Service and Leadership Award is given to a student who has served as a leader and has supported the orchestra program with their enthusiasm, hard work, and dedication, as well as made it a priority to present their talents through orchestral performances to serve their school and community. I am pleased to present this award to Kendra Byrne. Not to be outdone by the orchestra, the Vocal Music Leadership Awards will be presented by Miss Scully and Miss Lloyd. The Music Leadership Award is presented to a student or students who have shown the unique ability to inspire others to do their best by their enthusiasm and genuine love of music. Their fine example serves as an incentive to those around them this year's Music Leadership Awards go to Jacob Foreman and Kolo Thomas. I feel like it's been a while since we've seen Ms. Longo, so let's welcome her back as she presents the Outstanding Band Person Award. The next two awards, Outstanding Band Person and Outstanding Jazz Band Person, are given to students who have excelled on their instruments, who have been actively involved in Goshen's instrumental program, participating in many after-school, out-of-class activities, and who have become leaders within the music department. I would like to present this year's Outstanding Band Person Awards to two students who participated in numerous extracurricular band ensembles. They both spent many hours at rehearsals and performances throughout their four years at the high school. This year's recipients of the Outstanding Band Person Award are Jacob Robb. And Raiden Smith.
Well, that's just about the loveliest sound I've ever heard. Next, the Orchestra Achievement Awards will be presented by Ms. Kristen Callahan. The Orchestra Achievement Award is presented to a student or students who have, through hard work and personal practice, met meaningful and challenging performance goals in orchestra during their time at Goshen High School. It is my pleasure to present this award to Jay Jung and William Ortiz. Are you about ready for an intermission? Neither am I. Moving on to the Vocal Music Theater Awards. This will be presented by, once again, Miss Marion Lloyd and Kristen Scully. The Musical Theater Award was created to honor the student or students who have excelled on the GHS stage. They possess the natural ability to create memorable characters and motivate their fellow actors with their talent. This year, we are pleased to announce the Musical Theater Awards go to Kelsey Lindemann and Alexandria Thurda. Next would be the Cool Cats Award otherwise known as the Outstanding Jazz Band Person Award. My way of saying it is much cooler. This would be presented again by Miss Longo. This year's Outstanding Jazz Band Person Award goes to two students who have been extremely dedicated to the GHS Stage Band and who performed with the GHS Jazz Combo as well. Both of these students also auditioned for and were accepted into the High School All-County Jazz Band, and they both performed Level 6 Jazz Nisma All-State solos. The first recipient of this award performed with the stage band for all four years of his high school career, playing lead trombone for two years and then playing upright and electric bass during his junior and senior year. Please congratulate. The second recipient was also accepted into and performed with the New York State Band Directors Association Honors Jazz Band. This is an ensemble made up of only 20 top musicians from around New York State. Please applaud for our outstanding Barry Sax player, Donovan Teeple. Congratulations to all of this year's band award winners. The band program at GHS will not be the same without you. Is anyone else curious just how many instruments Miss Longo has in that room? Finally, the last award of the day is the Triad Award. This will be presented once again by Miss Kristen Callahan. The Triad Award is given to a student who has been actively involved in all three areas of our music department, band, orchestra, and chorus. This year's recipient is a member of stage band, symphonic band, concert band, chamber orchestra, jazz voices, and varsity choir. He has also participated in percussion ensemble, holiday ensemble, and has maintained a band he formed with his friends for several years. You will find him playing trombone, bass, percussion, trumpet, you name it. It gives me great pleasure to present the third ever GHS Triad Award to Connor Thornton. And let's let the curtain fall on that show for the day. Congratulations to our honorees. And coming soon, tomorrow, to a virtual auditorium near you, join us for the Catholic Daughters Greta Foley Scholarship, the Doc Brown Scholarship, the JM Electric Scholarship, and the Media Column Scholarship. I'd love to stay and chat some more, but I'm off to my Rockettes audition. Radio City Music Hall, here I come. How long before this guy can get a scholarship? <laughs> He's done great. Hey. I am amazed at how well behaved he is <laughs> at his age. He's a good puppy. <laughs>